Okay, welcome back to Let's Play Modern Fault in Vegas. This is James Seth Lynch, and we are... Where are we going? Alright, in this case, I have to use the little marker at this point. Call that a lizard? I fought bigger lizards with a switchblade. What's with the look, Six? It happened, okay? I've still got the scars. We're early anyway. You get the room, and I'll get the booze. Biggest dump town in the wastes goes to. Hey there. Well, welcome to you. You look tired from the road. Why don't you relax a spell? Let this fine town take care of you. What is this place? We're in a little desert oasis, name of Novak. This is the Dino Delight Motel. And it's mine. Is there any? Is there any of? What is there of interest around here? Well, there's Dinky, the town mascot. He's a sight. You probably already saw him when you came in, but you can go up inside, too. Up the roadways to the west, there's Repcon. That's the old rocket factory. There's been some sinister characters out there lately, so you may want to stay clear. Other than that, nothing to do but take it easy and enjoy good company. Anything else? Well, up north the ways, you'll see a big tower. That's Helios 1. Used to be a power plant in its day. And there's a town just east of here called Nelson. Used to be such a quaint little place until those slavers took it over. But we got our wonderful snipers keeping an eye in that direction, and so far, the slavers have left us alone. Tell me more about Repcon. I just know what I've heard. There's supposed to be some ghouls that went in a while back. Ever so often, there'll be a commotion from that direction. Explosions and such. Watch out for strangers! Apparently that was some sort of... I hope you're finding everything to your liking. Misdirected dialogue. Where can I get some supply? Uh, we haven't met yet. Okay. Oh, what am I doing? I got to thinking about making a good impression and plain forgot to tell you my name. I'm Jeannie May. I take care of folks here at the motel, long as they aren't troublemakers. Where can I get some supplies? Go see Cliff Briscoe at the Dino Bite gift shop and tell him I sent you. I think he gets lonely standing around in that dino belly all day. He'll be glad for the company. Looking for a man in a checkered coat. Have you seen anyone like that? Well, he might have been wearing a fancy outfit, but he wasn't any kind of gentleman to me. Had his nose stuck so high in the air you couldn't see it above the clouds. City folk. They always think they deserve better than what they got. Those hoodlums he was with seemed to know Manny for some reason. He's our daytime sniper, up in the dinosaur's mouth. What's been going on in town lately? Well, let's see. Dusty McBride's been losing some Brahmin, but that's probably the heat more than anything. Honestly, it's been real quiet. Ranger Andy's still hurt, but we got these two gentlemen snipers watching the road day and night, keeping the trash out of Novak. They've been a blessing. I'd like to rent a room. Well, I think that's a fine idea. I'll give you a good flat rate, and you can stay as long as you like. At least until the busy season comes. Sound good? 
There's a hundred caps. I'm glad you can stay with us. Your room will be the one upstairs, closest to the lobby side. Here's your key. Let me know if there's anything I can do to make your stay better for you. Goodbye. Watch out for strangers. So yeah, basically, uh, yeah. Uh, we have a room, uh, and this is basically our first little base in the default game, and then the standard vanilla game. That's what I'm talking about. This ain't too shabby, this place. Denver Triple Dog. Jets take you up, steady to bring you back down, then psycho for the hell of it. You game? <laughs> Try not to kill anything. Ah, uh, yeah. That's the stuff. So this deal. Fuck that man. I ain't doing shit today. Deal with it tomorrow. I'm heading to a new dimension. Steady does not last for very long. Anyway, some drug information. Psycho is actually a military based combat cam. Uh, basically, it's a downer. And highly psychoanalytic. At least I think I'm using the term psychoanalytic correctly. Um, it's something like PCP. You could see, yeah, something like that. It's kind of complicated. But it's not quite as dangerous as PCP. I know the route.
Then you found someone new. So love to add a dinky souvenir to my collection. God damn it. Don't sneak up on me like that. What do you want? Expecting visitors? Yeah, I guess maybe I am. But not like you. Huh. Maybe it should have been you I was expecting all along. Why are you here? Just want to check out the view. I think you better leave. I don't see how that affects me. Wait. You just got into town. Maybe you shouldn't go. Not just yet. Why is that? I need someone I can trust. You're a stranger. That's a start. You only trust strangers? I said it was a start. This town. Nobody looks me straight in the eye anymore. What do you want me to do? I want you to find something out for me. I don't know if there's anything to find, but I need someone to try. My wife was taken from our home by Legion slavers one night while I was on watch. They knew when to come, and what route to take, and they only took Carla. Someone set it up. I don't know who. Trying to track down your wife? My wife's dead. I want the son of a bitch who sold her. Uh, what do I do if I find this person? Bring him out in front of the nest here while I'm on duty. I work nights. I'll give you my NCR beret to put on. It'll be our signal so I know you're standing with him. Then I'll take care of the rest. I need to do this myself. How do you know your wife is dead? I know, all right. That's all you need to know. Goodbye. Yeah. All right, I'm running out of time here. I'll see you guys in the next episode where we continue to talk to Boone.